5, we got an exclusive tour today at Mercedes-Benz Stadium and found out how it's helping generate power not just for football games, but also businesses and homes in downtown Atlanta. Channel 2's Craig Lucy joins us now. And Craig, the stadium partnered up with Georgia Power to create solar energy. And believe it or not, on a day like today, they are still creating solar power. When the stadium opens up on August 26, fans will park under and walk under solar panels that will help power the stadium as well as the surrounding area. So on a day like today, are you all getting any solar power to the stadium? The solar panels absorb solar energy both from the top and from the bottom. Wilson Mallard, the director of renewable development for Georgia Power, gave us this exclusive tour of Mercedes Benz Stadium and how green the new Falcons home will be. It's an opportunity for us to show how solar is growing in Georgia. Georgia's the number five nationally in solar last year. You will spot the solar panels when you park and look up and as you walk in near the Falcons' massive sculpture. There's really panels in three locations right here at the entryway. There's over 4,000 solar panels here on site. These 4,000 solar panels will generate 1.6 million kilowatt hours. So we ask the obvious question, what will they do with all of this power? It's enough to power the home football schedule for the Falcons and 13 Atlanta United games. We met Scott Jenkins, the general manager of Mercedes-Benz Stadium, on the 300 concourse level, overlooking the solar panels mounted above a parking lot. The energy's feeding into the grid, and we take energy out of the grid. Georgia Power told me it's a multi-million dollar research and development project helping the stadium break a record. We're tracking for LEED Platinum and we want to be the first professional stadium to attain that level of certification. The canopies on the front porch aim for maximum solar absorption with hundreds of bifacial solar panels. We're able to turn the sun's energy into electricity, collecting energy from both sides. Additionally, where they're located, they help keep fans dry in the event of a rainy day as they wait to go through security and get into the stadium. Kept us dry today. The stadium general manager told me the nice thing about using solar power, he says the panels will pay for themselves over time. He also said under the solar powered parking garage, there are tons of electric vehicle charging stations, so they are about as green as you can get. Sophia? Craig, thanks. And we've created a special section with everything you need to know ahead of Mercedes-Benz Stadium's opening. Just head to our website, WSBTV.com.